it's springtime and birds are singing their songs of, of nature and um, everything is sprouting. Um, everything is budding. I, I see there's yellow out um, on, on the, the parkway where I live. The trees are, are just budding and you see the yellow and, and I see some greens and I hope you're seeing the same thing because it's just so wonderful and it's just so uplifting as well. You know, we can finally take off our heavy coats and, and shoes and hats and just let our hair down and just, oh, just embrace nature during this season that is just wonderful. And, and, and spring is the element of air. And so every opportunity that you have, get out in nature, okay? Just get out in nature. Put your, your devices down. Um, get offline as much as possible and be in nature, be in life and allow that, that living energy to just embrace you and fill you with light because that's who we are. We are light and we are energy. And the, the devices are fine, they serve their purpose, but you know, when we're on these devices for too long, they do interfere with our own electromagnetics. And we don't want that to happen. We want to continue to be in this process of awakening. And one of the most efficient ways of doing that is to allow for our beingness to continue to expand. And it does that in a wonderful way when we're more in nature, because we are nature, we're not connected to nature. We are nature. When we say we're connected to anything, that implies that there is separation. And we're not separate from nature. We're not separate from divine. We're not separate from our higher self. We are all of that. So it's just a matter of putting our devices down for a while and, and just being who we are with all that we are and allowing ourselves to be fed by all of that. <sighs> the element of air. Well, in nature, breathe, breathe, breathe in nature, all the lovely healing air that is there for us. <sighs> and be. Be with nature, the nature that you are. Allow the light of the blue moon, allow the light of the brilliant sun to fill you wholly and completely so that you can align with the light that's within you and allow the light that's within you to dissolve any darkness that might be there that's sabotaging your ability to be the masters that you are, the master beings that we all are. You know, this is a master number 11 year. It's a year of mastery. Let's be it. Let's be it. It's, it's, it's not about doing so much anymore. I'm sorry about the horns. It's not so much about doing anymore. It's about being, being the masters that we are because that is who we are. All that programming from the old paradigm taught us everything that we are not. We came here as love, but that love was not cultivated. And so now we're getting back to the love that we are. We're remembering that we are love. And as love, we are masters. And so it's time to, to be it. So... <laughs> I want to wish everybody um, happy springtime. Uh, allow all that you are to spring forth. Allow your beautiful, magnificent gifts of spirit to spring forth. Um, and happy Easter, happy Passover to everyone. And um, be in joy. Be in joy because that is our purpose here to live our purpose and to be 
and joy as we live our purpose and share our purpose with the world. Si tan tita la risamo colila, en ti la mosira din de le risa polu balai, le si ila bala di hilum, di hiloi, di hilu. Di tumbo si bala li paluka, Perat kan ti si tama, ala si tami kan ni tu le la, pin tu le la, pin tu lo la mai si kan ni te kasi na ni da la, elo somo ko pal mai le si, an monto le mai si kan ni te la la ko la bolen bika, ala sani a Teresa, ala sani le ti la si o mo ko le bai la le kan ti le la, an ti la si la no baluba, an di ko la bai samo, mon ti la, mon ti la la ko la la si la pon. Dalai salari ti la mulu, i hi fa wai, i lu wai lai, i pa la lu ha li li. En du pa la siu, mon ti ba lu pa li kong yu subira, te la po lo lai, ni fu pe lai sa mong kut al ba lu siu, al mong li kule pa la ri kya ni an si ta la, a ri te la, a la ti te te la sa, Pena di te la isa la ke ti la mola, ele sali te la, te la salotu, puna pa la melo, pena ka sini e te rekolma, e lo ka moda, ale si te li oto baba, te rekosi a la matiu la matita e si ti la mokalpe la la sala. E da komutu lo pa me le te la ka siuro, e te lo moko ma la si la di kandira, ala ti la pa lo le le, e la si mo di ka mo ti la ka si a la di to la balalu. Balalum, balalum, balai sani te kani te le esti stupa, esti stupa, esti stupa, tu ma ma la le koni te, ma lo ko la e sani, a si tu va la si tu va le le, a mo tu lu pa la li la, pa la li la ti na ti la di te si sa ti yo. Te a se de a, te a sa ti e tu ma ma, en ti la si de me lu tu la, a la san ti to na na le pa la si ka, en a ti se ti kan no, la pa Pari tu ma la si la na la le si to la bakan, a ko li san mi e tu la ba la, la po su po, a la tu si to ton ma ni a la san mo to lo ba, la si o to mo ti, an ti su to po kona, la si tan da le kona, la ti ta la si tan an da tu te la, lo su to rim, ma la si te no ko si mo to le ba ti la ba du, en e ka sa mo to da, ba la sa na tu te la le si tan an mo ta la, Tera da tera, ala si tu tu mo ta la e si te ta mo, ala si na ti ta la e sa, a si na ti ta de koni a tera si ta ni o to ba, tera si ka ti na da ti mo ko pa e sa la. Namaste. The light in me honors the light in you. Be the light. Be the love, be the vibration, be the frequencies that you are, for you all are the love, you all are the light. Allow your light to shine. It has come to that place for humanity to shine your light and allow that light to dissolve the darkness that exists here. There is a cloud of judgment over your world and it is that judgment that sabotages your ability to step forward into the light of your own divinity. And so it is for you to allow your light to shine. Surrender to the light that you are. Surrender to that light and allow that light to fill your life and illuminate your way forward. And as you, you do so, you also illuminate the way for all beings who are here, who are wanting to do the same. You give permission to others for them to shine their light. 
It is safe for you to be who you are. There is no longer any need for any fear. You are in the golden age of Aquarius, yes, but you also are in the era of light. It is your era. It is your, if you want to use the term time, it is your time for your light to shine forth into the world and dissolve the darkness that exists here. It is your power to do so. You are not knowing who you are, some of you. You are the question and you are the answer. It is not outside of you, it is inside of you. Even those who are walking in the light, some of you still continue to look outside of yourself for the answer. It is within. Look within and bring it forth, dear ones. You are doing well, though. We will say you are doing quite well. Continue to do well and bring others along with you and know that it is safe. There is no need for fear. Sit quietly in your meditation and imagine what your life would be like if you did not experience fear. What would your life be like without the fear? <laughs> and when you come upon the answer, begin to live your life according <laughs> To what it is meant to be without the fear. It is not real. It is the illusion that has been created for you and you have by default bought into it. Well, you can take it back to where it belongs. You don't have to exchange it for anything. Take it back and say, you no longer want it. It does not belong to you anymore. It never belonged to you, in fact. It was imposed upon you. <laughs> and it no longer has a place in your life. You are in the era of light and you are the light. It is your moment. Throughout eternity, it is your moment to be fully in your mastery expressing your light in the world throughout the multi-universe and so it is dear ones you are divinely blessed you are divinely loved you are divinely supported Is it? <sighs> Thank you, beloved Rainbow Council, for the gift of this beautiful message. And so it is. <laughs> oh, Ubuntu, I am because we are. And so it is. We are the infinite light of one love. <laughs> Namaste.